Hi, and welcome to the Visual Impact Studio inside the Media High building in Cape Town. Okay, we've moved from exterior, where I was shooting the exterior latitude test in, to the sun. I am now going to be shooting controlled interior test with diffused light, where I'm going to backlight our subject, front light our subject, uh, so you can see how the different rea sensors react to the different lighting conditions. I am also then going to underexpose by three stops and overexpose each camera by three stops. I'm going to continue now analyzing the test that we shot between the Radio Pick, the Arri Alexa, and the Sony F55. Okay, what the next test that we have is a standard front lit diffused light test. Okay, so once again in Scratch, I'm going to play all of them in a consecutive sequence so that we can actually see the difference between the three cameras. Okay, um, with the Arri Alexa, I am going to apply a uh, the D log light. Uh, just so that it kind of looks the same kind of space as the rest and gives us a good representation of what these three cameras do. Okay, looking at the red epic, what we see now in frame, you can see that in terms of the um, grayscale, it reads everything really well, nice rich black, good exposure range on, on Zelda, our artist, in frame. If we look at the statistics, really nice exposure range, a lot of information in the blacks. Um, the highlights on the stands are blowing out as you'd expect them to see. Um, really nice images that we have gotten used to from a Red Epic. Okay, moving along to the Arri Alexa. Once again, same thing. Really good exposure range. Nice spread on my histogram. A lot of information in my black, although I do see a little bit of noise here. Um, be seeing as it was shot in log C, we'll move it along and see what the highlight does. And once again, in my stats, highlight clipping where it's supposed to be coming off these two stands. Good exposure range between her and the background. Um, the only thing that I do see a bit of is some black noise, uh, which wasn't evident in the Red Epic. If we magnify that up a bit more, you'll see what I'm talking about, and you'll see it very apparent in this black area here. Okay, let's move along to the F55. Okay, if we turn our magnification off, sorry, and my statistics on, you'll see once again, I have a very good spread uh, on the histogram, a nice exposure range. If we move along to the highlights, you can see my highlights peaking on my stand once again are there, held really well. Um, good spread on her face, uh, good spread across the board. Um, and due to the compression codec, as with the Alexa, a bit of noise in the black. Um, if we push it up, really holds.